What's, what's your view of this uh, chalk demonstration here? As far as uh, protests or solidarity with people, free speech, it's fine. It depends on the message, and it depends on who you're supporting or protesting against. As all things matter, what your, what your intent is and who, you, and who it's directed toward. The problem is Black Lives Matter is a terrorist organization, and it is a Jew-hating, Israel-hating, uh, anti-Semitic organization combined between the members of the Nation of Islam and uh, something called Dreamcatch, as well as um, uh, the Black Panthers, the, the residual Black Panthers, whatever's left over from them from the 60s. Yeah, but this is not a Black Lives Matter associated or affiliated uh, demonstration, a political uh, street theater. Uh, yes, it is. Everything says Black Lives Matter over here. Oh. And they're, they're supporting them over their rampaging through our neighborhoods and destroying our businesses and tour institutions. And as a result, this is caving. This is taking a knee to them. This is surrendering to them to come out here and not protest. Where are they protesting the outrage of, of Gentiles of any stripe, black, white, or purple, or green with polka dots, coming and, and, and saying, F the Jews, F Israel, free Palestine, and writing it on our synagogues. Who says that is a good opportunity for them? Where are these people yeah. in this neighborhood when when a Jew is killed in Israel or anywhere in the world, and there's no justice for whatever t terrorist victim we are talking about to the tune of 3,000 over since Oslo started in Israel? You mean Where like, are these you people mean, then? You mean like uh, the... Uh, uh, black supremacist attacks on Jews in Muncie and, and in, in New City. Jersey City and in Israel with the, 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 the Muslim uh, terrorism groups, Hamas and, and who knows what else out there. This is, this is, these people are never to be seen protesting that on the streets. Where were they on Jersey City coming out? We're not going to take this outrage anymore, chalking up freedom and justice for the Jews of Jersey City. Where were they? Where are they? They're never to be seen. The progressivism, liberalism is their religion. Tikkun Olam is their calling card. They hide behind it. They think the Torah, that's all it talks about. And as a result, they're brainwashing their kids into thinking this is, this is worthy of them to come here and show caving out of fear to the blacks. They think the adults, the rabbis in their congregations and the parents think this is going to save their neighborhoods and their synagogues from attack because they have now taken a knee and bowed down and prostrated themselves to Black Lives Matter. Well, I have news for you. You just showed your weakness. You're going to make it worse for yourselves. But it appears that they are uh, showing their uh, uh, social justice um, and, and morality and displaying uh, a sense of, uh, of, of high moral and, uh, and ethical values. Yeah, well, it is uh, ethical values uh, that this Black Lives Matter organization published on its website in 2016 that Israel is an apartheid state, death to Israel, um, anti-Semitism openly. They took it down since 2016. They're supporting a group that has said this and there's open enemies of our people. So that's not a moral high ground. What this is? This isn't marching with uh, Martin Luther King for civil rights and justice for the bla for Black America. There was nothing wrong with that. But this is like prostrating yourself and caving, and collapsing before Farrakhan and before the the Black Panthers. This is this is absolutely an outrage. This is not the way. This is not what Jews should be doing, bending down to these people. We have to stand up with, where's our self-dignity? Where's our self-respect? You can't come into our neighborhoods and trash our synagogues and our schools and our businesses. And if you do, we're going to resist. The, the cowards came in on the Shabbos. They came in on Shavuos, the second day of Shavuos, the holiday. They knew there'd be no resistance and no fight back. Come, uh, come tomorrow. Come on a weekday when we, when, when we can stand and defend ourselves, you cowards. Antifa and Black Lives Matter, they throw from behind the, the, the crowds into the police in their demonstrations all over the country in order to protect themselves from being harmed if the police decide to fight back. These are cowards. These are evil people. They're defending, uh, the Jews of this community are defending enemies of Israel, enemies of the Jewish people who would like to do to the Jewish people what happened in Nazi Germany.